na amekuja kutembelea na niliongea naye akasema nikamwambia aje akutane na wasanii na producers wa machakos ndio muweze kumuuliza ya yeah, how come he's so successful you you are starting si ndio what is the trick to his success na i'll tell you one of them i was talking about in the radio this morning this guy composes every single minute anatoa wimbo wakati huo ameshautoa hata kabla hajafanyia video wimbo tayari ameanza kuutunga wimbo mwingine so he's producing a lot tulikuwa na yuko tuka shoot video while we are shooting the video walking around he is composing another song hiyo kabla ishi amesha compose another one tayari tuko kwa ofisi yangu amenionyesha songs that is already done about how many Three? ngapi uja release bado bado amesha zifanya hata video aja release ziko tayari zimeiva he is not even yet released because ile iko me releaseiwa haijafikia climax so he's producing a lot so that's one of the lessons i learned is that as a msanii si kuimba kwa kamoja unaweka kwa youtube alafu unajisiita msanii alafu unangojea unasema wa kenya they are not supporting you you have to produce a lot because it's in that production that you're improving and getting better and getting better so i'm very glad he's here he's come with a very good team uh, a large team wengine uko nyuma wengine uko kila mahali uh, i see robert robi robi uko hapa niko ndio watu mikono robi ametoka pia dar es salaam they work together huh? fumbo iko hapi ah fumbo shadrak iko hapi shadrak ah shadrak iko hapa ume blend in unakaa kama mkamba wa machakos kabisa nakaa sifu umetoka hapa kabisa eh uh, ah the director ameenda kule nafikiri wengine wako pale nje so amekuja a good team of seven people na tumekuja ku celebrate my birthday and his birthday we have a double birthday party so so on sunday we have a small party of a few people around 50 to 100 maximum in an outdoor area where atakuwa na release a new song for birthday that I meandika for our birthday it's a beautiful song and I was with him in Dar es Salaam as he was shooting the video and many others so karibu sana machakos hapa tuko sawa kabisa this is where development happens na tuko na oh tuko na section nito machawood like hollywood machawood ya ku support wasanii filmmaking na vitu nini eh tuko hapo sasa mko sawa sasa wacha ongeleshe kidogo bring a microphone please wacha ongeleshe kidogo wasalimie and then after that now you can ask him a few questions i think victor mesha organize moderated how it will going to be sasa so, salimia tu karibu sana na kitambo atoke hapa tumpatie jina yake kamba unajua anaitwa chui eh chui tawata yake kamba ngo 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 ya mambo vipi machakos ya mimi naitwa ngo Uh, before sijaja nilisema pia kwamba nikija Machakos nimesamani sana nionane na wasanii na watu ambao kwenye industry iwe movie iwe mambo ya production ma producer wanao shoot lakini pia wanaoimba at least tuongee vitu vichache uh, before hamjaniuliza chochote mimi naweza nikasema kile ambacho nakijua uh, ukiacha madini i mean dhahabu sio ruby hawa madini yanapatikana kitu ambacho kingine ni expensive ni ni, ni industry ya, ya i mean talent ni kitu ambacho kina thamani kubwa sana na kitu ambacho kimewapa watu wengi utajiri duniani so ni kitu ambacho ukiwepo nacho wewe unaimba uwe una shoot uwe unacheza jua kabisa upo kwenye industry ambayo Uh, ina mafanikio makubwa sana na ina thamani kubwa sana lakini ili uweze kufanikiwa kuna vitu lazima uvifate yani kuna vitu lazima uvifate ili uweze kufanikiwa uh, cha kwanza kabisa ni Mungu you have to believe in God first hicho ndo cha kwanza kabisa kwa sababu wewe unaweza kujituma sana unaweza kufanya vitu vyote sana lakini Mungu asipoamua kukubless uweze kufika popote kwa sababu watu wote wanaofanikiwa wanabarikiwa na Mwenyezi Mungu 
Kwa hiyo wewe ili ufanikiwe lazima umuombe sana Mwenyezi Mungu. Yaani fanya utakachofanya believe in God. That's first. Second one, work very hard. Work very hard. Yaani fanya kazi kwa bidii. Jitume sana. Tumia nguvu sana. Kwa sababu I'll tell you one thing. Kuwa na talent ni kitu kingine kujituma ni kitu kingine. Kwa sababu unapokuwa na talent tayari unakipaji automatic. Ukirekodi wimbo wote utakuwa mzuri. Lakini kama huto rekodi wimbo wezi atajua nani kama unaweza kuimba. Na most of the time watu ambao wako talented huaga wanakuwa wazito kufanya vitu. Usipokuwa unajituma uwezi kufanikiwa maisha yako yote. I'll give you an example. Nilikuwa nimefungiwa mziki kuna vitu vikao vimetokea in my country kuna wimbo tulikuwa tumeutoa ukao ume, umeleta picture nyingine kwenye government ukao band ukao utaki kupigwa kokote na utaki kuperformiwa kokote lakini sisi accidentally tulienda kwenye show tukaperform kwa wakatuzuia kufanya shughuli za mziki yani nikawa siko tena kwenye mziki yani wametuzuia uh, nakumbuka that time tukao tukakuja Kenya tukao na show so tukaiomba serikali kwamba please Watu washatupa hela yetu tunaomba tu perform. Wakasema sawa nende ni mkaperform. Tulipokuja huku nilikuwa na stress sana. Lakini kwa sababu nataka kujituma nilimtafuta Willipo tukaenda kurekodi wimbo wa mm, ambao umefanya vizuri sana na uko na views zaidi ya 20 something million on YouTube. Na umefanya vizuri sana pia Tanzania. Ukipanda kwenye stage hata simbi neno moja watu wanaimba wao tu. Lakini ule wimbo nimeurekodi nikiwa na mawazo sana. Nimefungiwa mziki, kila ninapotafuta kila njia imestopishwa. Nilikuwa na stress lakini still nilikuwa nafanya kazi. Yaani nimefungiwa lakini bado na record, bado najituma. Njia pekee ya kufanikiwa. Ukishamwamini Mungu, jitume. Usione aibu. Maneno ya mtu yasikatishe tamaa. Mtu yuko na, na mood yake unaweza kumfuata akamwambia bana toka bana sitaki kuongea na wewe. Unaweza kaisi kama ah hii mimi siwezi tena siwezi kunyanyasika. No. Unatakiwa vumilie ujitume ufanye kazi kwa bidii. Cha mwisho ambacho ni muhimu sana. You need to be very very humble. Hiyo hiyo ni muhimu sana hiyo. Kuwa humble. Kwa mfano by the time um Governor ananipigia simu. Mimi sikujua naongea na nani. Na niliongea nikamsikiliza, ya kaniambia nikasema, "Oh, alivoniambia jina na nini kwa sababu mimi na namjua." Alivoniambia ni yeye ndio nikaanza kujua, "Oh, kumbe nazungumza na yeye." Lakini most of the time wasanii ukishakuwa umehit, ukishakuwa unapata pesa, kokote unakopita watu wanakushangilia. Una, una, you feel like you're on top of the world like hakuna mtu anaweza kukuambia chochote unaweza ukao hauko humble ukakosa vitu vya msingi anaweza kukupigia mtu simu afu muelewe anaongea kitu gani ukakata au kumblock kwa sababu the time ananipigia simu ilikuwa sisikii vizuri lakini nikampa nika, 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 nika time nasemaje nikaongea naye ndio tukaelewana kwa sababu ukishakuwa msanii unapigiwa simu na watu wengi watu wanakuja tofauti tofauti unaweza kuchukulia tu nani bana ananiambia nini bana ye nani bana hicho unatakiwa kuwa very very humble mimi mpaka nimeenda wasafi nimekutana na diamond sio nilimfuata diamond nilikutana na watu wale walifanya niende kwa diamond nilikutana na mtu mmoja anaitwa cowboy ye ni jamaa anafanya kazi tu pale yani ni mtu ambaye ungetaka kumdharau ungemdharau akanambia no usiondoke msubiri nikamsubiri sio nimekaa pale mpaka amekuja diamond nikaongea naye tumekutana naye na kuna watu wengi ambao nilikutana nao nyuma ambao ukiwaangalia hawanipi pesa hawanipi chochote cha msingi lakini anaweza kukupata idea ikaje kukusaidia maisha yako so you need to believe in god you need to work very hard you need to, you need to be humble hiyo ni key ya kufanikiwa kwa sababu kuwa humble sio tu before hujafanikiwa au hujakuwa successful inatakiwa before and after kwa sababu unaweza kuwa humble unavyotafuta nafasi ukishaipata nafasi you have your money you have your respect watu wanakukubali you have everything you want so unaweza kuona kwamba ah, sasa niwe humble for what 
wewe wenyewe unasema unajibrand like you brand yourself but it doesn't have to be like that unatakiwa uwe humble unatakiwa umheshimu kila mtu unatakiwa msikilize kila mtu anachokuambia uh, nimekutana na, na kwenye, kwenye ofisi yangu next level nikamzungusha tumeongea vizuri the other day alikuja kwenye restaurant yangu tumezungumza pia so mimi niliona tu kama okay i have to respect him nilipokuja hapa nilicho kuja kukiona hapa ni hatari za mara milioni ngapi hata vile nilikuwa na expect nimefika hapa naona ni, ni anapendwa nimeenda white house unaona vitu vingi kama hivi ana interact na wasanii lakini ningemdharau ningechukua kama ah ananiambia nini bana mimi nimefika Kenya tufanye hiyo party niondoke lakini wai nakuja huku wai nazungumza na nyie kwa sababu nataka kushare kitu ambacho kinaweza kikaenda kubadilisha maisha yenu baadaye kwa sababu believe me mimi nimekaa zaidi ya miaka kumi napambana tu niweze kupata nafasi zaidi ya miaka kumi nakutana na watu na nidharau nakutana na watu wanantukana nakutana na vitu vingi lakini no mimi nilikuwa nimefocus kwamba mimi ndajituma ndamwamini Mungu lakini ndamheshimu kila mtu kwa sababu sijui nani ambaye atakuja kunisaidia so hicho ni cha msingi sana cha msingi sana cha kukushika unaweza kuwa na rafiki zako ulisoma nao unaona wamekuacha unaweza kuwa na watu wako unaona wanafanikiwa hutaki kufa moyo kwa sababu mafanikio anayepanga ni Mungu unaweza kuwa na rafiki yako ambaye umeimba naye umefanya naye production umefanya naye kazi yeye anafanikiwa we huko pale pale you don't have to give up utaka ujitume umwamini Mungu na uwe na nidhamu so hayo ndio kama neno langu machache ambayo nikuja niseme nifike at least ni share na nyie vitu haviji kirahisi mafanikio hayaji kirahisi unatakiwa upambane upigane usiwe na excuse kwa sababu excuse hainaga faida yani ukishachelewa sehemu afu kumwambia mtu i'm sorry yeah i'm sorry ni umesema ndio lakini haisaidi chochote wewe hapa sasa hizi mtu akifanya tukio lolote baya afu akategemea kusema i'm sorry haisaidiagi chochote wewe usipojituma saa hizi ukategemea baadaye utamlaumu mtu alikuwa aji kunisaidia alikuwa anifanyi iki hiyo haisaidii you have to make it happen utaki you, you don't have to look for excuse yani eti ni seme da nimemwomba jamaa nipeke studio hajanipeleka mungu ata mungu atamlipia afu nalala ndani hiyo mungu atamlipia haikusaidii wewe Unatakiwa utoke studio moja imeshindika nika tafuta tena option nyingine nenda studio nyingine wimbo mmoja umetoa haujafanya vizuri toa mwingine kazi moja haijafanyika fanya nyingine options yani utaki kukata tamaa utaki kukata tamaa na msikilize kila mtu anayekuambia usimdharau mtu usimsikilize eti o oh, huyu ndamsikiza governor au ndamsikiza Rivani tu we msanii mwenzangu utaniambia nini no wazo au idea ujui inatoka wapi mimi karibia nyimbo zangu kumi kumi ten songs ideas nimezipata kwa mtu mdogo tu mtu wa kawaida tu anaweza kaongea kitu tu mimi nikachukua idea hapo hapo naweza nikasikiliza wimbo wa msanii ambaye hajatoka nikapata concept ya wimbo mwingine kwa mimi Naamini mpaka umekuja hapa kuna kitu nataka kibadilike kwenye maisha yako. Mpaka umekuja umekaa hapo, umepoteza muda wako kufika, manake unataka mabadiliko. Trust me, Mungu anaona na mimi naamini wote walioingia hapa ndani watafanikiwa. Kuna siku itafika mtasema kwamba tulienda sehemu tukiongea na Rayvanny na leo kweli imetokea. Kama unaamini utafanikiwa na you be successful, let me see your hands up. Yes, you be successful, utafanikiwa na usikate tamaa. Hayo ndo machache ambayo nilikuja kuongea na watu wa Machakos. Mimi naitwa Rayvanny Vivani Boy Chui. You can call me Ngo if you like. I'm in Machakos. Ni yuko nyumbani kwa Chap Chap, si ndio? Um 
I was listening and taking some notes. I hope my people also taking notes for a story. Was Sky Tunde, you know, he said, given very good advice that every Kenyan artist should know everywhere. So Martin, no, no, Meka Tunde, you where your people are working, you know, so you, we need to, to move. Pengine, this time we can get some of you who like to interact with him. You ask him a few questions, you ask us a few questions, and then you're able to go back and forth. You understand? So you come out, come out, come out, come out, Okay. Just speak from where you are. Yeah, sorry, Vani. Any layer on get conget? Yeah, Rivani, kitu inyeiko the first thing kitu inyina to affect kama sisi wasani upcoming ni mambo na royalties. Unapata tunajituma like unaenda una hustle mtaani unatafuta do unaingia studio at least una try ku push una request kwa tv watu wanacheza tu kidogo venye iko but then una realize vitu zingine kama skiza tune at the end of the month unapata kitu kama 800 na uki, uki try kuangalia input yenye umeweka kitu kama like 20000 tv then unapata kitu kama 800 so like unapata kuna venye ina ku demoralize then Tuna, ukitrui kuangalia kwa, kwa mtandao kuna vitu zingine zinatokea platforms maybe unaweza tu advise ni platform gani inaweza tusaidia sisi kama wasanii upcoming na pia governor unaweza tusaidia juzi kama sisi kama wasanii wa machakos juzi tu like last week tumeshikana tukaungana watu watano tukatoa mziki mwingine kali sana but yenye tuko nayo ni like tunatafuta pesa mingi like tunachanga kila mtu maybe 15k 15k ume hustle Actually, to lienda Nairobi at least to try to change climate on even kama in as a work. So, to, to me try to me enda to me fanya audio apo, to kapata audio safi. But the issue is, after to me maliza kutoa iyo audio, unaelewa kwa industry venye mambo iko, like mna toa mziki kali, huku kwa ground, tukikuza park, una event, tuna hype, watu wanakubali, but unapata kama ujingia mainstream kabisa, inakuwa ningumu sana. So, like, kitu tunaweza omba sana, like unapata the, the, the production part at least we trying at least tunatoa mziki tunachanga tunafanya nini lakini sisi kama vijana tuko na hiyo audio nimefanya mimi ni to prince village kuna tuinami wako hapa kuna wasanii wengine bado hawajafika hapo sawa 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 yeah we get so, the point yeah sasa mimi naweza nikasema kitu kimoja yes you can sit naweza nikasema kitu kimoja uh, kuna point umesema ya kwamba unaweza kutumia hela nyingi au sio alafu unakuta unapata kidogo sio lakini pia unatamani kuona kazi yako ikichezwa kwenye media kubwa sio unatamani kuona kazi yako inaenda mbali sio na inarudisha ki, zaidi ya ulicho invest si niko sawa mimi naweza nikakwambia kitu kimoja before hauja record before hauja ingia studio you need to be very sure na wimbo wako usi usijiamini kwamba umefanya kazi nzuri before hujaifanyia research uliza watu alafu pia kuwa msikilizaji tumia hii technique angalia nyimbo gani zina hit this time around nyimbo gani zina hit wanatumia tekniki gani kitu gani cha tofauti ambacho kipo kwenye wimbo ambacho kimeteka kime attention ya watu alafu wewe sasa fanya ya kwako kwenye njia hiyo yani just like that song ambayo ina hit in your way sio nielewa kwa mfano Ch chukua tetema laba my song tetema unasikiliza ule wimbo naona alifanyaje watu wakapenda wimbo ah alifanya hivi chukua kama ule but do in your way. Ongeza vitu vyako, fanya vitu tofauti. Kwa sami, I'm telling you, you be wasting your money, your time, kama utokua unafanya kazi ambazo unazipenda wewe tu. Mm -hmm. Alafu unenda unaitoa. Watu, watu, kazi kiwa nzuri. Ata usipo mpelikea DJ. Wenye watu ata uchukua atapiga. Wacha ni ongeze ya pukidogo. Unajua, I'm a filmmaker. And uh, there is something that a lot of artists like us don't realize ya kwamba you think you are good but you should not be the measure of your goodness 
Unasema nimetoa kibao watu wanapenda my friends like it lakini unajua si friends wako natolea kibao natolea the world je hiyo kibao yako ukiya kwa youtube hata kama tune bila hata video how many people will like it and how many people will listen to it unakutana watu 50 peke yake your friends and relatives lakini mwingine anatoa ina hit 10000 20000 inafika 1 million why because that tune is catchy you tune imeshika watu yes you know you have to make things for the people yes rivani alisimama akaongea kuhusu alianza kuongea kuhusu madini akaongea kuhusu god alafu akasema juu ya entertainment money is in entertainment but it, you have to be good let me be brutal eh? if you suck you suck if you are talented you are talented it's as simple as that so you have to listen to what he's saying that you have to look at what makes people succeed what kind of songs ndio watu wanataka kusikiza then that's where you go lakini ukisema mimi niko na style yangu nitafanya kivyangu niko na friends wangu wimbo umekopoa sana and then nobody else wants to listen to it then you fail so you have to go with things that really attract a lot of people na pengine hata atakwambia kuna nyimbo zake anapenda sana ila anajua ni wimbo mzuri lakini yes. people don't like it ndio kweli eh hey, ila anafikiria yimbo moto watu wapendi na kuna zingine anachukulia hivi hiyo ndio watu wanapenda hiyo ndio anaimba sasa iko hivi hapo naongezea kwamba kutengeneza hit song kutengeneza hit song very easy you need to get people's attention hiyo ndio secret ya kwanza unatakiwa upate attention ya watu by the time mimi natoa wimbo wa kwanza niliwaza nitaimba wimbo gani ambao mtu akiwa anapika akiwa anafanya kitu chake akiusikia aache aanze kunisikiliza nikasema okay wengi wanaimba baby nakupenda au mtu anaambia ndakupa nyumba na gari au nikasema okay mimi niimbe wimbo ambao namchukua mwanamke ambaye tajiri nampeleka kwenye maisha magumu kwetu ndio ile sifa kwa Mola wangu Maulana unaongea vitu ambavyo kwenye no, kwenye maisha ya kawaida mtu mwingine anaweza ongea unamwambia mimi nyumbani sina umeme sina sina hiki nyumbani kwetu pabaya we don't have a good life hakuna mwanaume anaweza kumwambia mwanamke hivyo lakini hicho kitu kikifanya mtu ana, ana, anaweza kazingatia e eh, amewazaje kufanya hichi kitu kwa mfano sikiliza hata nyimbo za miziki ya Kenya kuna miziki ya Kenya mingi ambayo na hit Tanzania ukiangalia ilivyo ni simple iko creative So you need to do something like that ili watu wa attract kwa sababu wanaonunua kazi ni watu wanaosikiliza kazi ni watu mziki ukiwa mzuri hata watu waubanie ma DJ wasipige mtaani una hit hata watu wasipo utaka yani mziki wako utatembea wenyewe ikiwa umetengeneza wimbo ambao unachukua attention za watu usifanye kitu ambacho kila mtu anafanya Ukiimba oh umeniacha moyo wangu naumia na maumivu baby i miss you kila mtu anaimba ili upate nafasi unatakiwa ufanye something different sio kwa mfano watu wanaimba na kupenda mimi nishaimba wimbo sikupendi unaelewa sijui unaenda opposite na watu wanapenda kuna nyimbo mtu anaimba ita wazima moto tunazima moto na dawa ya moto ni moto hiyo something simple lakini ukisikiza wewe ukisikia unapenda nimesikia uh, nyimbo za, za, za nani uliza kiatu angalia wimbo kama ule mtu kaimbia kiatu vitu ninavyopata tabu nini wewe uliza kiatu hata mimi nisipokuwa sipendi mziki nikisikiliza tu idea unajikuta umependa sio easy love songs au nyimbo za mapenzi au nini hizi ni nyimbo ambazo siku zote zinapendwa ila it depends na melody ulotumia kwa sababu na nyimbo zingine za mapenzi zinategemea sauti yako zinategemea maneno umeyapangilia kwa mfano unaweza kusema unaanza kuimba tu unasema mimi nitakuoa inawezekana vipi yani Yaani wewe umekutana na mwanamke hujamwaproach hujaongea naye umekimbilia kumuoa inawezekana So hata ukiandika nyimbo za mapenzi is like you are telling story ni kama unahadisia anza 
naanza mwanzo na msifia sura nikimaliza kumsifia sura na kuja tabia nikimaliza tabia na kuja kumwambia wanaume wengine wasimfate so ni wewe the way unaitengeneza kazi yako ndio the way utakavyo iuza hivi unanielewa sijui unaweza ukaweka ukaweka 1000 ukapata hata 12000 au ukapata 20000 from 1000 na unaweza kaweka 20000 usipate chochote kutokana kwamba wimbo uliotoa wenyewe haukubebi sio kwa hiyo ili kazi yako iwe nzuri ufanikiwe maana yake we mwenyewe unatakiwa utafute kitu ambacho ni kizuri sikiliza miziki iliyotoka wanaimbaje ikiwezekana copy sio mbaya ukikopi na ukawa successful ina ubaya gani ndio maana watu wengine wanaonaga waimbe covers at least watu wamjue kwanza Inga ukiimba covers sana ukija kuimba wimbo wako watu wanakuwa wamekuzuia kwenye covers but you need to do something better ili iwa attract watu nafikiri ni kujibu sawa yeah. kuna mwingine tena habari zenu kusalama okay uh, i want to speak for the machakos artists and uh, dancers and the whole department of machawood and with all due respect bwana governor eh uh, tuliona vision yako about the machawood and the youth of machakos and it was a great vision and i think you being the lead of the vision we you should be the main motivation and we know you had the purpose to give us a a platform to grow as artists uh, but in the midst of everything i'll talk about this today uh, you being the motiv- motivation there have been issues as artists about payments it's something that i do really respect my friend you know you have yeah. to learn you see this is how you succeed or fail yeah There's a platform for everything. Yeah. If you have issues with Machawood, you talk to them. Here Ivani is talking to Kenyans about how to enhance music for artists. Yeah. Not your own personal issues. So can we give a lady so that he can also hear a voice of a lady? Unajua kuna this is how you fail, eh? You've not even taken off and already you've got a tire burst. So if you want to grow you know this man doesn't live here he's come here to talk to you to give you advice because we want you to succeed and so take advantage wisdom says you take advantage and milk him for all the notions and the the you know the information he can give you to succeed that's how you succeed in life yes um governor revani and everyone good afternoon Uh, my name is Elizabeth Nzilani. I'm a model. I have two questions for you, Rivani. Um, as an established artist and part of Wasafi, it's my dream in like let's say one or two years to be a brand ambassador maybe or do sales advertising. Um, my question one, what do you look for when you look for such a person to maybe represent your brand? to be in your videos and such or maybe to be the face of something and to as an upcoming model what can i do and which part can i focus on to achieve that thank you okay 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 very good uh first um yes cha kwanza oh nataka akae ili aweze ku concentrate yeah <laughs> Yes, you can hear, you can hear me well. Uh, as I said, kwenye kila kitu you need people's attention. You are a model, right? Unatakiwa upate attention ya watu. Nguo una wewe uko na social medias. Find something different that people will talk about. That's the way ambavyo unaweza ukafika mbali. Kwa mfano, Unaweza kutumia saa. Hizi saa watch. Ukatengenezea nguo, ina saa hapa, ina saa hapa, ina saa hapa, ina saa hapa. 
ukawa kwenye social media kote kesho kaweka nguo ina be creative find something ambayo itakuwa na attention kwa watu ambayo itavuta watu wa, wa, wa kuongelee then wewe kutokea kwenye video kutokea kwenye matangazo as a brand a brand ambassador is very easy kwa sababu watu wanataka kitu ambacho kinaongelewa mtaani unanielewa sijui watu wanataka kitu ambacho kinaongelewa mtaani kwa mfano mtu anaonaga ni utani wa facebook au anaonaga ndaonekana kome, kome nafanya comedy lakini no ni creative unaweza kachukua majani ukatengeneza nguo as a bra ukatengeneza siki vitu gani ukapiga picha ikawa kwenye social media zote Kenya na watu wakakuona sura yako kesho na kisho kutwa kuna watu wanatangaza brandi brand zao wakataka kutumia wewe lakini ukitaka uonyeshe uzuri sijui hate uwe na urefu huu uwe na nini ni, it's very hard to penetrate kwa sababu there's a lot of models wazuri wengi kwa ili wewe uweze kupata nafasi you need to do something different find your way unanielewa sijui kwa mfano unaona hizo hizo umevaa hiyo hiyo mask you can have a thousand mask you make a clothes for it imeziba hapa hii imeziba hapa hii imeziba hapa hii imeziba hapa umepiga picha yes i'm telling you ukipiga ikionekana huyu ataongea yule ataongea huyu ataongea eh bana wewe mbona ukatengeneza hii ja, wengine watatania wengine watakuchukia wengine watafurahia lakini tayari ushaongelewa watu washakuona Unanielewa? Kuwa na vitu tofauti. You have your time, tafuta outfits zako tofauti. Sio, hata ukitaka upige photo shoot za sura. Umeona ile video ya Beyonce kafanya na na shata wale wa Ghana. Kuna watu wametokea wamejipaka rangi. Kama umeangalia video, wamejipaka rangi. Alafu ukiangalia ile video iko very creative. Vitu kama vile. Unaweza ukaenda ukatafuta nguo sio ukatafuta nguo ambayo theme yake inaendana na na nini na mnyama yoyote sio ukapiga katikati yao yani find different ideas ambazo ziko tofauti mradi tu isivunje sheria ya nchi ukawa si umekaa uko naked no 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 but you need to do something creative upate watu waweze kukuona mamodo wako wengi sana Ukiposti picha zile zile mpaka watu waje kukuchagua wewe yani hiyo itachukua muda sana itachukua muda sana yani wewe you need to find your your your, your, your way ili watu wakufate watakataa tafuta nyingine watakataa tafuta nyingine hivyo ndio ambavyo utaweza kufanikiwa lakini speaking about sisi ku shoot video mimi naweza nikamwambia tu director nataka models kumi, ishirini kwa hiyo usiwe sasa eti wamechagua models kumi wote wewe ndio ukawa extra. Ila ukiona vitu unaonekana kila mtu atataka kutumia. Mtu iko South Africa atasema I need this lady in my music video. Ni nataka tu aje na hizo barakoa zake na hizo mask ni shoot naye. You you you, you may get Kwa, you, you have to be creative ili watu wakuone. Kwa mfano mimi wasanii wako wengi sana. Wako wengi sana kuna techniques nyingi sana za kufanya mtu uweze ku, 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 ku sustain ya kuweza kwa mtu uweze ku maintain pale ulipo hicho ndio ambacho naweza kusema tengeneza attention be creative utapata vingi sana utakapo kwenye billboard zote mark my words in other words anasema ya kwamba you have to stand out eh? in my book how to be rich in africa another secret of survival naongea kwamba you have to do things watu wanasema who is this Oh huyu ndio yule alifanya. Ah, oh huyu ndio yule. Ah, all of a sudden you may not even be the best, but because you've done something, all of a sudden you are picked because you have something that can be attributed to you. You and you only attributed to things that you do, not what you think about. And it doesn't matter how much money you have. I mean, I started publishing a newsletter myself with no money, which I used to sell during Christian religious functions for 3 shillings. Yes. But from that nikaenda watu wakasema ah wewe ndio ulikuwa na kale kama magazine ulikuwa nauza ah kuja hapa because i did something si kusema serikali nisaidie sijui nini nisaidie you have to show initiative yes. there are many good artists there are many good musicians there are many good alavila amesema why him why him why others 
next level uh, studios, NLM. Yes. Uh, he's got his own studios. He's got his own artists now. Yeah. Artists ni wengi. Mbona amemchagua huyo artist na huyo artist aanze kuwasaidia? Because wameoneshana potential. Na si kusema mimi msemi because wamefanya vitu huko hata bila pesa. Wana record tu hata bila pesa. Akasikia aha, huyu ni mtu amefanya nini? Initiative na akaweza kumsaidia. Kwa mfano, kuna msanii alikuwa ameimba wimbo Tanzania. Ana, anauliza nitoke vipi? Huo ndio jina la wimbo. Like how can I be a star, a big star? Anajiuliza yeye mwenyewe maswali. So anataja nyimbo za wasanii tofauti. Rayvanny alimba wimbo huu ukamtoa. Sijui nani labda kama hapa Kenya, Kariglaf aliimba sijui wimbo huu. Akaja Sauti Sol wakaimba wimbo huu. Bahati kaimba hivi. Nani aimbe mimi niimbe vipi sasa? Au niimbe kama alivyoimba msanii huyu au kama niimbe kama alivyoimba msanii huyu na akatoa wimbo na ndio wimbo huo ulimfanya awe star mhm mm yani yeye anajiuliza atoke vipi lakini ndio wimbo ulimtoa kuna msanii mwingine anaomba kolabo mm -hmm. <laughs> kwenye wimbo anasema nimempigia Rayvanny apokee nampigie Diamond apokee au nimpigie msanii huyu au nimpigie msanii na ametoa wimbo huo mm -hmm. na wimbo anaotoa una hit Ko ni vitu ideas tofauti tu ambazo zinaitiki. So lazima wote uimbe idea hizo lakini hata kiima mapenzi yawe creative. Hata kiimbia siasa iwe creative. Unaweza kutoka hapa it may sound weird to you lakini unaweza kutoka hapa ukasema mimi nafanya kolabo na kuku. Kuku na Ehe. Ehe. Na nikatengeneza hit. Unaona mimi hapa naweza nikaenda nikaimba wimbo na mbuzi Eh. Yeah. Na nikafanya video mbuzi wengi na ikahit. I'm telling you, it's just usiogope kutukanwa. Mimi nimeimba wimbo wa quarantine na wasafi tumeimba wote. Watoto wameimba turn around, so you do this, do that, go left, go right. Ilivyopika pati yangu mimi sikuimba maneno yote. Nimeimba sha sha kinkidiki. Kum 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 kum. Kinkidiki, kum kum. That's a verse. Mama, kaj, ay 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 ay. Oh, 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 oh. Ni me Maliza. Asa ni me tole wimbo. Kila mtu na sabo sando ni nivi. Diamond ni nemi ando me Maliza. Ni kasa ni me Maliza. Kila mtu alikuwa naona. Ame fanya jivu. Wimbo ni potoka. Watoto wote. Mtoto tamba ya juu kuongea. Ana imba my verse. Ni kama wimbo na wakia watoto. Hata kiwa mdogo analia, kaya wikia wananyamaza. Ana enjoy, wanacheka. Nikiena kwenye show, wanaimba pati zao zote. Ikifika pati yangu na wakia watu maiki tu hivi. Sha, sha, kinki diki, kum, kum, kum. That's music. Meee. Yes. Ya kuna jamaa tenda kutafuta kukulewa. Hakata kuimba mkule. Seme yo chatupike hii. Unajua <laughs> Simesikia your creativity eh? It's basically thinking out of the box And being able to push the limits Me I have a lot of faith in our artists Like here in Machakos And in Kenya Our artists are brilliant Lakini we have uh, something that started during the Moi regime Ya kuwa confined Lazima usaidiwe na mtu Di ufike mahali Some of us have usaidiwe na mtu Misi ya kuwa governor kusabu ni usaidiwe na mtu Ati ndio ni kafika mahali katika my, my career When I was a kid I was supported Lakini in my career Nimefanya vitu so that I was way ahead of other people. Be creative. Don't complain. Don't whine. Don't criticize. Don't pull people down. You work on your talent and being able to push it. Okay, work on your talent. Will be, I hire people. Why do I promote some people in my county and I don't promote others? Because when I promote mtu, ambaye yuko na initiative. Hatu ki promote ye, kila mtu nasema, eh, hui anaweza. Because you can tell they have initiative. Hangoje ya ulizwi, amefanya. Ukisema nani amesha afanya? Kata kama kitu jafikiria, amefanya tayari. Initiative makes a very, very big difference. We've had, uh, we've had uh, uh, an artist speak. We had a uh, model speak. We had a complainer speak. Is there a producer? Do you have any producer? Yeah, a producer. Lakin like before jafika kwa producer, producer. Mm. nigeongea kitu kengine tena, usi tafute watu. Kabla ujajitafuta wewe. 
Yaani we mwenyewe unatakiwa na content nyingi before ujaanza kwenda ku, before you start looking for help. Sababu wengi wanaaminiki kufanikiwa ni kutafuta watu. Eh bana nina kipaji bwana nisaidie ndugu yangu bana nini? Haya imba, anaimba vitu vileweki. Una nyimbo ngapi? Na nyimbo tatu. Like seriously? Kuwa na content kwanza wewe. Yaani wewe mwenyewe uwe uko fit. Unajua kabisa nikitokea same nikimwambia mtu nina talent akikataa akataa yeye tu. Mimi nikiomba kolabo kwa msanii nampa option ya nyimbo ambazo akianza kuzisikiliza hamalizi. Kwa sababu wewe mwenyewe lazima uwe na content nyingi. Yaani lazima mwenyewe ume, umefanya vocal training, umesikiliza watu, wewe mwenyewe jikubali wewe kabisa kwamba yeye hapa niko sawa. Hata ukimfata mtu akikwambia show me what you got umpe kitu kinachoeleweka. Wengi wanaaminiki kufanikiwa ni kuwa busy kutafuta watu wa msaada. Wapo hao utahangaika miaka mingi kwa sababu kila naye kusikiliza anaona huwezi, huwezi na ukati tamaa. Unatoka Nairobi unaenda Mombasa, unatoka Mombasa unaenda huku, unatoka Machakos unaenda huku. Lakini vitu vyako ni vile vile tu. Hata yule ambaye ulikutana naye last time, umekutana naye last year, umekutana naye mwaka mwingine, mm-hmm. anakuambia ni imba nikusikie, unamwimbia kitu kile kile cha last year. Yaani wewe you are looking for help. Lakini unata, ujisaidi mwenyewe. Kitu kizuri hata mimi nikikupa my story ilikuwaje mpaka nikawa msanii, nimeenda kwenye competition za ku za ku freestyle. Mm-hmm. Sio hata kuimba, ku freestyle like a freestyle, uandiki rap freestyle. Yo, I see you do this, do that. Nimemaliza ku freestyle, nasubiri majibu, nikawa nimekaa nje na gita. Naimba. Ndani mashinano ya ku rap, mimi niko nje naimba. Akatoka mmoja wa supervisors wa kwenye nini akaniona naimba. Akapenda ninavyoimba kuliko ninavyo rap. Akachukua namba yangu akani record kwenye simu nikamwimbia kwenye simu ile sauti alio record kwenye simu akaenda kuipiga radio so you can tell sikumfuata sikumwambia naomba nisaidie nilikuwa naimba mwenyewe nje lakini ndani nilikuwa na mashinano ya kurap you see maana nilikuwa niko na content lakini wengi wengi wanatakaka kusaidiwa wewe unamwona kabisa ukimwona huyu hawezi ila yeye anaamini wewe umekataa ume, ume tu anakuacha wewe anamfuata mwingine mwingine akimwambia ajui asikilizi anaondoka anamfuata mwingine hivyo unaweza kwa haso hata miaka 40 na usije kwaje kufanikiwa unatakiwa na kitu ambacho kiko attractive kuwa na content una nyimbo nyingi unaweza kuwa na vocal ambayo kimwambia mtu akasikiliza jitahidi hata play instrument chache mu attract mtu before yani wewe mwenyewe ji usiseme kuhaso ni kutokuwa na aibu ndamfuata yoyote no 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 jiangalie mwenyewe kwanza huko vizuri uliza rafiki zako karibu waimbie ushadrak aloka hapo mimi nimekuwa nime naye nimekaa naye mtaa mmoja nimesoma naye from primary hadi kuna mtu alikuwa anacheka wanajua nilivyokuwa na wasumbua naweza kasikiza wimbo mtu nikamfuata imani sikiza wimbo unasikia sauti hizo zipanga sasa yeye hicho kitu sio kitu sio kitu chake hayuko interested nacho sasa kuna mtu mwingine anacheka wana, wana, wana joko wanaweza akasikia wimbo sehemu nyingine wakanishtua right unasikia sauti like a joke kwa sababu najua ni vitu ambavyo napenda so ilichukua muda mrefu sana kujitengenezea vitu vyangu mwenyewe kiasi cha kwamba ukimfuata mtu hatakiwa hata kukuuliza mara mbili anasema huyu anafaa sasa kwa mfano mimi hapa kwa wasanii wa hapa waliopo hapa nitamwambia uh, kiongozi hapa kwamba kwa sababu nyinyi mko na group au mko na nini atatuma kazi tofauti mimi nasikiliza Niko na next level music ambayo inachukua wasanii pia. Kwa unaweza kushangaa hapa pia kuna wasanii ambao wanaweza wakashukuliwa next level. So it depends. Ukiwa mkali, we'll be good to go. Ukiwa huko au uko mkali, hatuwezi kusema eti mtu atakufuata huwezi afa kuchukue tu. No no no. Ni biashara. Ni biashara, it's a business. Eh, kwa nivo, kwa hiyo mmesikia mmepewa offer. Sim club kidogo bana. So you can studio zake if you are good and askizi ajue you can sell amesema atakuchukua yes. and support you because he's supporting your he's not supporting at your talent he's supporting your music because he wants to make money out of it Usifikiri ati mtu anakusaidia tu hivi hapana kila mtu mezaliwa peke yako hakujui endo ukasaidiwa na baba yako au mama yako kuna mama wa kusaidiwa hapa ni biashara you do talent 
Tengenezea mtu pesa atakuita mtengeneze pesa na yeye uvume. Yes. Si hata diamond, hata diamond aliniambia. Akasema eti niko na wewe sio kwamba wewe ni mdogo wangu yeah. au ndugu yangu. Ni kwa sababu tunafanya biashara. Eh yeah, biashara. It's a business. Show me the money. Yes, ukiwa huna talent tena, uwezi kuandika tena, utaona tu mtu anakukimbia. Wewe tutaongea, tutazungumza. Ujue kabisa mambo hayajakaa sawa. So kila siku na pia nikwambie mtihani hujaisha. Kutoka ni swala lingine ku maintain ni swala uh-huh. lingine it's very easy kama unafanya kazi kwa bidii very easy very easy lakini it's very hard kama we ni mzito mafanikio hata kesho hii unaweza kushangaa ndo siku yako ya kufanikiwa kwa you don't have to give up unatakiwa ujitume uwe na content usianze kumtafuta mtu wa kusaidie kama hujajisaidia wewe mwenelewa sijui kujisaidia wewe ni kuwa na content zako wewe Labda tumsikize yo producer. Kabla producer I went to Tanzania. Unasikiza wanacheza nyimbo. And I asked myself which songs do they play from Kenya? Artists ni wengi sana. Nikasikiza wanacheza a lot of sauti so. Wanamcheza Otile Brown, uh, Calligraph, Nadia Bahati, Fee, you know Bahati wanamcheza Bahati sana. Nikashindwa ni kwa nini? Nikaenda Uganda nikasikiza which kenyan artist do they play nikasikiza ni sauti so bahati wale wale tu nikauliza mbali lakini kenya tuna so many artists na genge kuna nini how come they are not playing the, the artist songs zetu kenya mbona wachezi tanzania lakini ukienda club yote hapa nairobi uende club yote uh, uganda nigeria unasikia nyi wa raivani Mboso unasikia lava lava tunacheza bongo kila mahali why why are we playing tanzanian music more than they are playing our music it has nothing to do with choices it is because it is what the people want si ni kweli tumepita pale saa hii tukakuta wasichana pale wa mumbuni girls wakaona raivani wakawika akaangalia mmoja akafanya hivyo akatetemeka Why when I'm from high school kids why do they know Raivani from Tanzania Akaanza kuimba wimbo wakaanza kuimba na yeye Because it is a song that transcends Wewe ukijiimbia tu yako ya mtaa yenu hapa tu Machakos ama Nairobi ama Nakuru nyinyi peke yenu you're not talking to the world and then Dar es Salaam they don't they're not listening to you So you need also to write music and also sing about topics that do not put people off that people want to listen music that people can listen and they able to to grow with it producer yeah mr governor rivani and all the creatives Good afternoon. My name is Ondiko. Kwa majina naitwa producer Ondiko. I come to speak uh, my sentiments kama producer na kama artist manager and promoter. Okay, so my question goes to in relation to collaborations. And when I'm talking about collaborations, watu wengi wamezoea ile collaboration ya kawaida ati artist to artist collaboration like for for instance askia Ivani niaje nataka tukuje kufanya collaborations i'm speaking about a label to label collaboration for example i own a label hapa machako sini to horizons media where i deal with artists kama wewe so my question is do you have avenues that mimi kama label tunaweza fanya a benchmarking with you kama next level when i said benchmarking other than just calling an artist to your studio maybe i choose my team come and exchange ideas with your management or something Yo, that's my question the other question is what's your marketing strategies what's your top cream marketing strategy in terms of so as a producer najua kama artist always make peke yako behind an artist lazima kukuwe na mtu kama a producer a team a road manager a pr a radio plug mtu anafanya ngoma yako isonge you as an artist you should just concentrate on making music so what's your hierarchy like from rivani kuna nani hapa nyuma nani ivo ivo we need to know that sasa so, so. and another thing 
just a general sentiment maybe at a governor pia anaweza sikia uh, something that guys are jajua in in machakos you have great artists and i've worked with the top cream artists in kenya pia like calligraph jones akina nonini nimemfanyia album uh, tile brown akina nadia so mr governor i know you have the energy and the the power with just a snap of your finger to make history in machakos like what uh, today rivani came to machakos me as a governor and takwa proud like in some years to come I made some headline mali that some artists did some good job with some top cream artists from Tanzania. So that's my dream. Thank you. Okay. Uh mimi nitaanza na hiyo ya kwanza sio. Naanza na swali lako la kwanza la label na label sio. Uh kama nilivyosema mwanzo it depends na kazi yako ambayo unataka tu fanye kama iko nzuri ambayo unaona kabisa itakuwa na impact tafanya sio lakini there is another way ambayo hiyo ndo normal kwamba mtu yote anaweza akaja anataka kufanya kolabo na anataka kukulipa before jalipa pia lazima nisikize kazi yako iko sawa kama haiko sawa tunaachana nayo natafuta songwriter au mimi i write for you unanilipa nafanya lakini kwa wewe kwa sababu we family already sio uh, nimekuja hapa kwa ajili ya, ya governor sio kama kazi yako ni nzuri na nimependa kazi yako me i can do it is not even a problem kama kazi yako ni nzuri i won't charge anything tutafanya that's a promise lakini speaking about speaking about uh, uliongelea swala la umeongelea swala la label to label lakini umeongelea swala la strategies strategies cha kwanza kabisa ni promotion promo kila kazi unayotoa lazima iwe na promo umeelewa lazima ufanye promotion ya kazi yako mimi nikitoa wimbo wangu hata nilio shirikishwa lazima ni upromote ndo watu waupende ndo watu waujue sometimes kitu kinaweza kikawa kizuri ila kisiwafikie watu so you have to promote it there is a way of promoting the songs kupost kwenye social media um ku promote kwenye radio stations lakini pia ku ku ku, ku um kulipia digital platforms promotions kama spotify itunes huko youtube kuna njia ya ku promote ambayo unatoa pesa wanai promote kazi sio kwa sababu kazi bila promotion pia haiendi kokote kazi yote unayotoa hata kama ni kazi yako umeitoa lazima una strategy za promotion wimbo wangu wa kwanza nimeutoa kwa sababu nilikuwa natafuta nafasi nilienda kwenye bus station niko na CDs tofauti tofauti niko na flash na wapa bure yo huo wimbo wangu utawa player watu kwenye gari sasa watu wakiwa nasafiri kutoka one region kwenda region nyingine wanasikiliza kama hapa Bachakos kuna sehemu ya basi uko na CD zako na wapelekea pale unawapa bure tu wakisikiliza ndio wanaanza kukujua hivyo napeka kwenye sehemu za baa ndio hivyo kwa nafanya hivyo mwanzo napeka sehemu za baa sehemu zingine wanakataa toka na CD yako wanakataa sehemu zingine wanakubali hivyo ndio ambavyo nilikuwa nafanya promotion zangu mwanzo na post sana Instagram na sambaza kwenye magari nafanya hivyo lakini sasa saa hizi kwa sababu watu washanijua shafanyaje siwezi kaza kuzunguka kwenye mabasi tena kwa sababu nyimbo zangu wananijua na najua hata kazi nikitoa nispo post watu watatafuta wao lakini still na post na promote hata vinywaji test ni ile ile tu kinywaji chochote unachokijua wewe test ni ile ile toka miaka hiyo lakini kila siku wanakuja na strategies za promotion msimu huu wanakuja na promo hii msimu wanakuja promo same to music you have to promote your music hata wewe umesema una label you have to promote your artist you have to promote your songs unazozitoa hiyo ni strategy pekee lakini hilo la mwisho muongea la machako wasanii wa machakos mimi nafikiri nyinyi mnajijua mngejiorganize mngejua msanii gani ambaye ni mzuri sio ambaye mnamwona ni mzuri lazima awepo mmoja ambaye hata kama hajatoka hajafanikiwa lakini nyimbo zake at least zinapata pata nafasi 
Sio. Huyo mumpe kazi moja. Afanye wimbo. Akifanya wimbo wote mzuri mnaongea na governor. Anaweza kuorganize msanii yoyote Nairobi akafanya. Hiyo ni easy way pia ya msanii kufanikiwa. Alafu huyo msanii sasa anakuja kuwa kama kioo cha Machakos, sio? Mnapopata msanii mmoja ametoka hapa ambaye hivi ni wasanii gani ambao wana hit kutoka na uh, Kenya wanatoka Machakos? Ni nani? Nimesikia nani anatoka Kayole sijui nani? Nani? Kuna mwingine sio anatoka wapi? Nani mwingine? Anaitwa nani? Bahati bahati ametoka tu hapa. Kila, kila wakati bahati anakuja hapa Machakos every so often ni mzaliwa hapa. Anaitwa Nani? Kaplen. Anaitwa Kapnea. Ah, anaitwa Kapnea na anatokea hapa. Yeah. Na yuko mainstream. Yeah, yuko. Hata right now ako na some projects on going na Calligraph Jones. Na Calligraph Jones. Yeah. You see? Kwa lazima mwana wasanii wengi wa kutoka Machakos ambao wana huyo 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 mnaweza mkamtumia akawasaidia vitu vingi sana. Kurekod na huyu, rekod na yule. Mimi mtanitumia kazi zenu nitafanya wimbo mmoja na msanii wa kutoka Machakos, sio? At least at least tuseme kwamba kuna siku tulikutana tuka organize meeting, tukaongea na baadaye ile miti ikaleta matunda ikawa na impact sio mm -hmm. so tulikuja tukaenda na tukaendaaga ndio ime, imeisha no 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 haitaki kuwa hivyo kwa nataka tufanye kitu ambacho kitaacha legacy pia kwa mtua governor sio kesho na kesho kuta tunasema tulikuja tukafanya kitu ambacho kilikuwa kina impact kwa mimi ndasikiliza kazi zenu ambaye kazi yake itanivutia will do it sa yeah. I think we've talked quite a bit. Maybe we can get a final question from a lady. A lady? Do you have a lady artist? No musicians? Sizani kama kuna swali tena. Hakuna ladies wana maswali? Comment? Uh, there's a gentleman aminua mkono pale. Karibu ainua mpa boja na migu. It's a final question. Uh, Vipi chui? Atari baba. Ah, poa. Mimi naitwa Pantha. Mimi yes. ni chui mweusi pia. Pantha, ah, right? Ya yeah, marapa. Okay, for us for us artists tunatoanga muziki fit lakini chenye wengi wetu hatujui ni ku market through hizo media platforms, hizo iTunes, hizo naona ngona market kila mahali hadi Spotify. Yaani kuna secrets mingi zenye si hatujui. So tunaweza pendelea utupatie tips the platforms will also work how to put our work there and how to reach out to our market and to everyone ah uh, okay. mimi nacho nasema ni kwamba hiyo itakuwa short ni muona jamaa yuko pale ana label sio excuse me kama ah wenye label ni easy you need to find a team sio mtu wa digital ambaye atakuwa na upload kazi zako ni very easy ni kama unavyojisai unavyosajili namba ya simu ndio hivyo unakuwa na account yako ya audio mark ya diza ya boomplay unaweka kazi zako kule and your social media yeah. usitumie ku post picture tu panther panther no 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 promote your work weka kazi zako pale true alafu pia kitu kingine kasa umesema we ni rapper sio yes rapper ili ufanikiwe forget about releasing songs you nini kwanza utakiwe na freestyle session true ili ya kufanya live au ya kupost video una rap about anything yeah about artists wenzako about nini ili uwe na run kwenye mitandao iku promote zaidi true ila hata sisi Tanzania tukuone fresh umeelewa sijui yeah. ni kama vile wanavyofanya cyphers yeah umeelewa actually kuna tumefanya cyphers ya artists hip hop artists huko machako yeah. zinaitwa 016 cyphers yes. mali tunafanya hizo freestyle sessions and now na iko fit sana yani na yeah. to pia confidence na creativity keep doing it keep grinding mafanikio yapo shukran eh yeah, amna chui ana feli yeah yes mshukuru pia chui atafanya collab na panther soon <laughs> bless <laughs> hasa i think i want to say thank you very much uh dugetu uh, rivani chui go
Uh, you, know, you know, you've got a lot of things to do in the radio stations this morning. Uh, he's going to be releasing a birthday song, so he still needs to look at it and do a few things. So yeah. we have to take him back to where he's staying and everything. But we really appreciate it. Yeah, so we have to make a lot of collaboration with Direct Machawood to get a session ya watu wa digital kuwafunza watu wetu how to market your products digitally and there are many free ways of doing it so wafunze those techniques si ndio ndio waweza kufanya hivyo and then uh, all i can ask you is that me I'll, i'll provide an environment for you but it's up to you i'll bring rivani here it's up to you i'll set up machawood it's up to you uh, you can complain you can criticize or you can take advantage of the little there is and run with it Success is all about you looking at something and looking at the positives and running with them. And that's what I ask you. Wherever you are in this country, we are live on Facebook. Oh, no, not on NK na tuangalia hapa. Oh, that's good. Mbona piana mawaidha mazuri sana. They are writing from Nyeri, oh, yeah? from Kirinyaga, from Mombasa. Watu wanasikiza. Oh, that's so, good. you know, I ask everybody here and, 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 and then the other thing is never give up. Huyu kijana never gave up. Anaambia vile story alikuwa huko, ana piana vitu kwa kwa bus station. It's about initiative. You get out there and do it. You disclose rumati utasaidiwa at serikali ya nisaidia, mimi sasaidiwa. Nani? Hakuna. I went to Tanzania. Those artists don't call, don't have a the interaction at serikali na wasaidia na kuwapatia pesa. It's private business the same way it is in Hollywood. The same way it is in California. So go and look at the history of uh, these big houses for example in the US. You know? You look at those big recording artists how did they start utakuta kwamba hakusaidiwa na mtu alikuwa anaosha vyombo na anaimba usiku anapeleka tape anafukuzwa anapeleka anaenda watu wanasoma ana harmonize kidogo anaangalia anasikia that's how you 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 grow you struggle you struggle you grow but don't wait for people to at sijasaidiwa they are not helping us uh, they are not helping locals and you know? it's hakuna mambo ya kusaidiwa unajisaidia if you're good enough I Mutua will notice you even before Ivani and I'll support you. Tuko sawa tu wangu. Mefurai. So I want to say thank you very much and uh, what you can do is mnaweza penda pale nje you arrange yourself with seats properly and then we'll come and do a group photo with you. Asante na Mungu awabariki. Over and out.